be training with. So essentially you're training, you know, let's say 200 units at a time. You can see that losing 150 of them is not a big deal. It really is not. So, um, yeah, it's, uh, it's really just a pushover. It's just a matter of putting hours into it and, uh, you know, claiming all the land, all the cities. So, because of that, and, you know, the fact that I don't have uh, any more things that I'd like to show off that, you know, features of the mod or anything. Um, yeah, I just don't have anything like that. So, um, yeah, I've basically shown all there is for now. Uh, I know that there is a, a new Prophecy of Pandor coming up, a new uh, version 4. This is uh, version 3302, I think. Uh, the, there have been a couple of updates, but... Uh, yeah, this is version 3 dot something, and, uh, you know, version 4 is, uh, gonna bring a whole new factions, and, you know, they're gonna do a lot of stuff with it, and, uh, you know, considering what they've done here, it, uh, will definitely be amazing, so, uh, I'll definitely be playing that, if I'm going to be let's playing it, though, I'm not sure, um... Because I've done all this, and, you know, this took so many hours now. And, uh, yeah, I, I guess I am gonna just call it here. Uh, and I mean, call it for the Let's Play. Which is weird, and I'm not a, you know, it's not a credits rolling screen. But, uh, I think I've demonstrated the power that I possess. And, you know, it's literally just putting some hours into it, and I can... You know, go conquer Sarleon and Marleon. There's nothing left of Sarleon. You know, it's it's just putting hours into it. I I can get the power now, and I can basically steamroll everything uh, if I wanted to. Wanted to. Empire would take a bit longer, but I would win. I would come out on top. I've I've just gotten that powerful. So um, yeah, there there is nothing really left. Uh, I've shown an older, which are a big feature, which are really cool. Um, yeah, it's just one of those games you you, you should play for yourself. If uh, you know, if you want to see more, go play it for yourself. Because I, I can tell you that the uh, you know your situation will be very different. Uh, and that's that's really the gold on you know what's so good about the uh, Mountain Blade games, or. Mountain Blade and Mountain Blade Warband, let's say. Um, it's, you know, every every game will be different. And uh, every faction will behave differently. And it's just really interesting. And they're great games. And, you know, they're not even expensive. So, uh, considering all the mods you can get for them, there's some other really good ones. But in my, my personal opinion, uh, at this point in time... Nothing comes close to uh, Prophecy of Pandor, so that's why I uh, decided to let's play that in the first place. And I'm glad I did. And I think I've uh, shown everything I could have. So, if there isn't, uh, do let me know in the comments. Uh, you know, inform me of it, and I'll see if I can do it. And, you know, it's got to be worth it, though. Um, and I don't know what I'm going to do with this. I might just... Uh, go play when I want to play, or... I don't know, I'm probably gonna check up on uh, Britain Walda. Because that is actually w the other mod that uh, I found to, found to be really interesting. And came second to uh, Prophecy of Pandora, so you should probably check that out if you're interested. Um, yeah, I, I guess I'm just gonna end it here then. It feels really strange, because it's been such a, such a long time. But yeah, do uh, tell me if there's anything more that I really should be showing. Uh, I don't think there is. Um, yeah, with regards to uh, Prophecy of Pandora 4, I don't know what I'm going to do. I might just do a let's introduce uh, or something, uh, you know, uh, show. I think a let's introduce would be fair. Uh, you kind of know what to expect from a Prophecy of Pandora. And with a Let's Introduce, I'll show the new factions, and I think there's four or five even. Um, and probably a new map because of that. Uh, so that will be uh, really cool to see. Um, 
from what I've uh, from what the the uh, modders have put out. It's going to be really interesting, and uh, yeah, I think a lesser introduce is going to be fair, because uh, you know putting an out another 200 plus hours into this is a bit much for a let's play. Uh, you know, it'll be in total 400 hours of uh, me playing Mountain Blade simply for the let's play. That's a bit much. I'll definitely play it on my own, but uh, yeah, for a let's play you're really bound to it, and that's kind of restrictive at times when you want to play other games and you still want to, you know, not let the let's play completely die. Um, you want to play when you want to play, right? That's also what I want to do, so... Um, yeah, you can probably expect a uh, let's uh, introduce from Prophecy of Pandora version 4, if you're interested. Uh, that'll probably be coming, uh, assuming it comes out and it is worth doing. Uh, if not, then this has been Mountain Blade, Let's Play Mountain Blade Warband, Prophecy of Pandor mod. And I hope you guys enjoyed that, and I'll see you guys next time. See you dudes.